good YouTube what's going on everybody welcome back to the channel it's your man Mohammed Kamara in this video we're gonna do a little bit of a different scenery all right I want to give you a little house tour you know I've been here for a couple months now and I haven't really done a house tour I've been doing just the tutorials you know what I'm saying doing all the regular daily drop shipping stuff but I want to actually give you an inside look into my lifestyle kind of motivate you guys and in no way is this to show off all right I've been here for a couple months now already but I figured I got a couple requests and comments so let's go around and take a look at what we got going on here uh, as you can see this is the kitchen section over here I don't spend too much time here and if you check out my stories on Instagram first of all follow me on Instagram at most so legit that's with two T's but I do have my personal chef come through and she usually chefs it up over here so she get real busy. I got my blender and stuff and whatnot, of course. But come through to this section. I'm gonna show you how to, um, my little office area over here to your left side. So it's a little bit of a mess right now, you know. Gotta apologize for that, but you know, that's how I like it. I like it a little, I like chaos sometimes. You know, you need that. But come over here to the right side, we do have our actual workstation and this is where I spend most of my time editing all the videos, uh, doing drop shipping, doing my live drop shipping calls every Monday with the students. I spend a lot of time over here. And yeah, this is a standing desk, but you can't move it. Something that I personally wanted because I, I hated the fact that I was sitting down all the time. And I don't always work inside the crib, but when I do, I like to be comfortable. I like to be able to move, you know, I like to stay active and all of that. Y'all gotta excuse my tree here, right? Because <laughs> this was once a beautiful tree. And if you check out the previous videos on this channel, you'll see that, yeah, it looked a lot different than this, but I've been spending a lot of time traveling. Just got back from New York, actually, so I haven't been able to keep up with the, the maintenance on it, but we gonna get another one around springtime. You know, I'll keep y'all updated on that. But uh, yeah, of course, we got the workstation that spent a lot of my time here, like I said. Uh, we got some, I got my nice little yoga mat for when I wanna get active during the nighttime. I like to cool down by doing a little yoga every nighttime or early in the morning, catch the sunset and whatnot. But let's move on to this next section. I wanna show y'all uh, just my, my chill area. So, I do also spend a lot of time here. Uh, got some plant action going on. I like these modular couches because when I have friends over or company and I wanna basically make use of the space that I got going on, I'll basically open up these couches up. You know what I'm saying? So, big reason why I bought them. They're pretty modular, very, very comfortable too. So, um, if any of y'all happen to come over, just know that this couch is most likely where you're gonna be sleeping because it will knock you out fast, all right? And of course, I love playing chess. I think it's a very symbolic game of life. That's what I got going on here. So, um, paintings, okay, so colors. I like. I wanted to do like a, I don't know, I wanted to do a big contrast because I, I have a lot of neutral colors down here and a lot of gray action going on, like the two-tone with the carpet. But I wanted some black to really pop out the room. So a lot of the accents and whatnot is really gonna be black just so I can get more of a pop and get some life in here. But yeah, that is my idol right there. Shouts out to Kanye West for always keeping it a buck and being original, even though he can't be misunderstood sometimes. All right, but uh, that is my guy. Fuck with him heavy. And this very melanated woman that, of course, you, that's just a must. You just need that in the crib. <laughs> but. Yeah, this is the balcony area as we're approaching. We got a dope view. One of the big reasons why I chose the apartment. And yeah, it's a little foggy right now, but this is where I usually catch the best sunsets at nighttime. It's usually a great place to just sit, cool down, think, read a book. And when that sun is shining, I'm talking about it's hitting right here because the sun sets right there. Right there, so you usually get some crazy scenery of the sky changing colors and whatnot. You probably seen it in my other videos too, but yeah. Uh, let's move on to this this TV area. As you can see, we got some like meditative music. These are binaural beats, and I want to to add some value into this video for all my my money team members out there. 
listen to some binaural beats. They have like these different frequency waves and they just help you focus, help you relax, and help you stay in a meditative state and kind of, I just like, you know, playing that. You could put it on in the background, pop in some headphones while you're doing your work or you're trying to focus. It's really gonna enhance everything and help you out. Uh, got the surround sound system over here. There's a bass in the back actually that I, I can't really show you right now, but that's what the plant is sitting on in the back. And uh, Xbox, of course, all of that good stuff. We got some Apple TV action going on in here. So it's, it's just real comfortable. I wanted this place to be very flexible, make use of the little space that we do have, hence the modular couches, hence the, you know, the, the minimalist design. It's not really minimalist, but I wanted to do a float-in sort of uh, TV stand rather than something going down because I didn't want to block the door to the to the entrance. I wanted to make use of this space. So just some of the ideas that I had going on when I was decorating this place. Let's step into the room. Of course, I value my sleep, so I had to get the biggest bed, most comfortable bed out there. It is a Casper mattress, okay? So, um, Casper, y'all owe me some credit for, some, for this or something. Give me like a shout out or coupon code so I can share it with my subscribers. But this is a Casper mattress, king size. I really like the modular, you know, this very minimalist design, low sitting bed. We got some TV in here too for whenever I want some leisure by the bedtime. And yeah, just to talk a little bit about the artwork, of course, the one and only Notorious, okay? Got a rep in New York. And we got that Africa Pandam painting over here just to, you know, keep things down to the roots. And I want to show y'all this flag right here. For all my Africans, all my Africans on the channel, y'all already know what this is. Vergeon Rouge, this is from Mali, okay? Everybody's been asking, am I Gambian? Am I from Senegal? Am I from Guinea? All right, there's a lot of West African countries that got close, but nobody really quite gets this right. And I'm from Mali. It's one of the most, like, it's the biggest country over there, but there's not too many Malians over here in America, so I'm really proud to rep that. Let's step into the bathroom. And again, I didn't do the best job cleaning up. I wanted to keep it as like cozy and natural as possible. But yeah, we got these like two sinks over here. Very, very nice counter. This marble counter we got going on. We got some tub action going on too, right? I never actually used it. That's the crazy part. I never used this tub. But um, yeah, hopefully one day I can make good use of that. One of my favorite parts is really the shower, right? It's the, the glass shower, you know, when it steams up, it just, I don't know, it creates a nice ambience for you and you just, I don't know, for some reason, having a glass on the shower makes the shower better. I don't know how, but it works. And got my little aloe vera plant. Everybody say hi to the aloe vera plant. And then, yeah, we got a nice little pantry here with just some some items and, you know, some random household items and whatnot. Not too much going on in there. But, yeah, walk-in closet, too. It is a bit of a mess right now. That is something that I am working on is the wardrobe, which I've been slacking on in the past year because I'm just so heavily invested into the businesses and whatnot. But, um, yeah, we got some work to do. I like the space. I like having that comfort. You know what I'm saying? I want to show y'all this little poster over here of Africa. I actually got this when I was living in Africa, um, what was it, like seven years ago, right? So I lived there for two years and I got to really get in touch with my culture, learn my language, learn where I come from. And this was a very, very significant purchase for me because I went to the market and as you can see, it's written in French and it's actually a mud cloth, right? Very prominent like material that they use in West Africa. So, you know, I got that just to remind me where I'm from again. Once again, this is just a nice little space. I like to call it the kingdom. It's like, to, you know, where I like to get my work done, where I like to chill. Um, one thing we did miss, I want to show you this. That little hustle, okay? It's all about the hustle. It's all about the hustle, all right? So you need little reminders like this to, to remind you of why you're doing this. What, what are you doing this for in the first place? And for all my business owners out there watching this, I write this whole thing off, okay? All my taxes, I write this rent off because I use most of it prominently for office space, all right? And as you can see, I got this whiteboard. We skipped over this. I got this whiteboard. 
uh, pretty much it feels like the wall so I can just get creative I can let my thoughts flow and I could just you know jot whatever is on my mind at the time so that I don't forget it's really important to write like I've been telling you how to do and of course if you want to stay active you got my little pull-up bar I've been saying that I've been um, putting on some muscle weight well this is the trick all right that's my little secret right here let's see if you put this to work real quick Get some nice little blood flow in between your work. It allows you to think better. Stay loose. And yeah, that is a little bit on my apartment, all right? So I, would, I just want to cap this off by saying, look, this is not in any way to show off or anything. I just really wanted to put some value out there for everybody, you know, aspiring to get a place like this. I come from the projects. Okay, I come from a three bedroom apartment with seven people where I had to share small spaces with um, family. Even though you love them, it's like still very small. It's annoying, all right? So if you're aspiring to get a place like this, damn, that shit got me out of breath. <sighs> so bottom line, if you're aspiring to get a place like this, look, it's very, very possible. And it's actually beneficial to your business because you can write it off at the end of the day. So. Um, if you're new to this channel, if you like what you see, make sure you subscribe, like, comment. Okay, I want to know, I want to know what you think about this apartment. Okay, go ahead and comment down below. What would you add? What would you change? And what does your dream apartment look like? Okay, I want to see your thoughts. Comment that down below. Also, I am posting a lot more on Instagram right now, so go ahead and follow me on Instagram at Moso Legit. <laughs> Damn, I'm out of shape. But yeah, I'm gonna catch you on the next one, Money Team. It's your man, Mohammed Kamara. I'll leave some other videos for you right here to check out on how I actually make enough money to be able to sustain a place like this. And you know, all the resources are there for you to learn if you want to, okay? Use my channel. It is basically like a free course on how to make money, okay? Using e commerce more specifically. So again, I'll leave another video for you right here. It's your man, Mohammed Kamara. I'll see you on the next one, Money Team. Peace.